want to switch gears and talk about a built-in environment um, because we also do a ton of that. And I think sometimes when people ask us what we do, it's, it's kind of hard to explain. Um, we do a lot of a lot of things. So this project is in Williams Tower and we were in the building for, um, for the same client for, for another project altogether when this one came up. Um, the contractor, Gallant, was like, can you do this? And we said, yes, of course we can and we can, but I wanna tell you guys about um, the parts of the process that don't always go so smoothly and um, just, you know, kind of how to handle that. So um, the part of this picture that you're seeing that we did is those black elevator surrounds. Look super simple, right? Um, we didn't do the wood. There was another Miller contractor altogether for that, but um, those came into the building ultimately in one piece, all three of those things. And it seemed like a really um, easy and great idea at first. Um, we did all the site measurements. Um, we fabricated them off-site, obviously, and brought them in in one piece. Um, where it gets tricky is when there's a really, really tight fit required and um, it's construction, things change. So when we went to install them, um, number one, they are heavy as all get out and they had to go to the powder coater. Um, so back and forth several times, um, they're kind of flimsy in three pieces. So we actually, you'll see in one of these photos, um, we had to do some bracing that had to be cut off in the field to keep them from breaking. Powder coating is really durable, but it's very difficult to fix once it's not at the powder coater, so you have to be extra careful with that. Um, so there was a lot of challenges before we even got to the site, but then we got to the site and the ceilings were lower than they were supposed to be. Not by very much, but steel doesn't like to flex very much in this, um, in this configuration. So... So getting them into the building was a very big challenge. Um, we did it overnight. I was there. I was part of the installation crew. Um, we had seven people to move each one of these six elevators around. And it was hairy from the loading dock all the way into putting them in place. Um, we learned a lot of lessons on that one. Actually, we learned probably lessons on every one. But uh, we would do it a little differently next time. But what I am most proud of is how simple they look once they're installed. I mean, it's beautiful. This is like my favorite kind of design. Super simple, sleek, um, looks like it was no big deal. And behind the scenes, the complexity of simplicity, as we like to say around here, is just, love it.